we're exploring today outside of Hope, British Columbia, and we got the Othello Tunnels. These are tunnels that were constructed um, over the last hundred years to uh, for the railway. And but during that time, because of all the maintenance that those tunnels had, with rocks falling on the trains and things like that, they they decommissioned them, and now they've set up some hiking trails. And so let's go see what it's all about. I like how they closed the train tracks because rocks were falling on the trains. So they opened it up to the public so they can just walk around and have rocks fall on them instead. Wet, damp, very cool. It's really big too. I don't know if it's capturing how high and wide it is. Obviously to fit a train to it. Kind of dark, isn't it? <laughs> We're here doing one of these bucket list things. Uh, today we're on the Fraser River uh, going sturgeon fishing. Uh, this Fraser River is known for being one of the best places in the world to catch the sturgeon. Sturgeon is one of the largest freshwater fish that can be caught and so we're going to put our lines in the water and see what happens. I'll just get him out and we'll go through the bites and what happens. You want to try and set your own hooks? Me too, sir. Sure. Right now, so you can really count on it. Trying to fish paws, I don't get fished very often or not at all. Woo! <laughs> trying to get in touch? Oh, he's mad. Come on, Dad! Come on. Come on. Get that. There's nothing to see yet. Is it a big one? <laughs> Hold on, girl. You have your life jacket on, Don. That's a good one. Daddy, you got a big one. Woohoo! Easy, try and get him all good. Who's winning, Don? Who's oh, winning? Oh. <laughs> He's not running anymore though, eh? No, it's just like dead weight coming up now, right? He was putting weight down. Yeah, he Ooh, wow. There yeah, he is. Cool. Oh, he's... Yeah, oh. I'm just trying to unclip the weight. Measure it. So we're just trying to straighten him out a little bit. Oh. <laughs> you know, we're not going to get wet. Oh, can you're like tangled in the table. Okay, we go from the tip of the nose, go on the outside of him. Yeah. Tip of the nose, and the fork in the tail. Just lift the tail up. And there you go, six footer. Uh, look so at we them. were just out on the Fraser River. Radic, our guide here, double header, uh, put us onto the sturgeon. We were just fishing about two maybe minutes. two minutes, and the fish hit yeah. the six foot white that's sturgeon. A, that's a beauty. Fight of a lifetime. Yeah. It was amazing. <laughs> so pumped. All right. <laughs> oh, he thought oh, about it. Just a bit. He's so light. Are we oh, reeling yeah. the other one? All right, so we're on to fish two here. We've cracked out the uh, belt for him to wear. This one's already done a big jump and has pulled the line out. So it's another big one. Oh, he's 
<laughs> just running that. <laughs> For sure. Cool, that's bigger, I think. Yeah. I think he is bigger. Yeah, well, maybe. Not as fast or not as thick, but yeah. yeah. Thank you. Ah! <laughs> Alright. Yeah. There he goes. Oh, Holy, listen to him run! Belt. Dad? And where are the little guys going to show up? <laughs> yeah, poor, poor Alice isn't yeah. reeling one in today, is she? <laughs> Sorry, kid. Still running. You got a lot of reeling in to do. Holy, that thing is. Yeah, that fish is gonna take you in in a minute. <laughs> just, uh, just about to put a light jacket on him. <laughs> Oh! 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 Uh, that's like 250 for all. That's a big fish, man. Oh, nice, nice work. work. As we left the rainy skies of Vancouver and headed west through southern BC, the sun came out and the geography changed. From high mountains and lush vegetations to a much drier landscape. We began to see many fruit farms. It was a great way to end our journey through Canada. We will now be making our way south through the U.S. towards Yellowstone National Park.